Donna Vekic does what Donna Vekic does. She's playing an amazing match here. Welcome to Tennis in a Minute. I'm your host, Good Energy. Iga's fiance, if you've missed this outburst, yelling at her coach. Um, she was upset. You know, she had some words and not necessarily directed at her coach, but yelling at the fact that Donna Vekic sent a rocket past her that she couldn't catch. So upset, looking at her coach, frustrated, saying some words. Now, listen, guys, Donna Vekic is an amazing player she's powerful i was a bit a bit offended by what the announcer just said the announcer said so essentially listen guys donna vekic in the first set she won 58 percent of igas fiantek's second serves that's right 58 percent. she's destroying her second serve now here here in the third set it's 15 15 donna vekic had the chance to essentially attack a second serve and go up you know 15 30 on Igas Fiantek serve but she did not go in on the second serve so the announcer said that is something top players don't do she said top players do not make mistakes like that so essentially her direct words were Donna Vekic is not a top player that's that's what she said she basically called Donna Vekic not a top player and I, I disagree. Look at the grip on Iga. Look at the grip, guys. Look, I, I disagree. Um, I think Donna Vekic, in terms of power, without a doubt, I, I possibly have her forehand, backhand, definitely in the top 15 strongest players on tour, without a doubt. I consider Donna Vekic, I consider her a top 20 player. I mean, she was a top 20 player a few years ago, four or five four years ago when the tour was a lot stronger and competitive. Now, I don't necessarily think the tour is that competitive. I think, and, and look, no disrespect, but I think the level of competition now, it's just, it's just not as strong as the tour has been in the past. When Serena was playing, you had to be good and strong, right? Um, you had to be skilled. I think a lot of players now are lacking uh just fundamentals of the game. I think more players now are just trying to bulk up, get strong, and overpower you. I think the shot making, the the ability to volley, use top spin, I think that's declining. And this little guy is enjoying this with his little racket. So I disagree with the announcer. I think Donna Vekic, I think she's a top 20 player. I uh, mean, it, it shows she's climbing back to where she belongs. I think in terms of her power, she's a top 15 player. And she's proven that she look, just look at the competition she's beat in the last six months. She's 20 and six on the season. And I just don't think there's many players on tour that's hands out better than her. And I mean, her shot making ability, I think she's a, a pretty decent server. Um, I don't I don't know. She's been attacking the second serve. She's winning 58 percent of them in the first set. It's been a strategy, clearly. I don't know. Maybe she had a mental lapse. Maybe she lost focus. Possibly. Polska. Polska in the building. That's a Jordan fist pump. Iga does hold. She ties it up at three, but Donna Vekic serves ahead again. She's now up 4-3 on serve. I think Donna Vekic is a top player, so I disagree with the announcer. Look, it happens. I, I do think if you have a mental lapse like that, it's unacceptable. If that's the game plan, which it appears to be, you have to step up and take advantage of that shot. You have to step into that second serve and put it away. So I do think that's unacceptable. But to call her not a top player, I disagree with that. What do you guys think?